Hello, I'm Johnny of Johnny Jams Piano. I'm going to take you on a tour of the application. First, first thing you need to know is how to hold it. To get the most out of the Johnny Jams Piano, you hold it with your pinkies and your thumbs. Actually, you just use your pinky from the left hand. Your right hand fingers are for the keys. The gold ring notes indicate the major key, and the blue ring notes are ones you use for the blue scale. And your left hand is for shifting through the different key layouts. Zero sharps is C, and one is G, two, D, three is A, four, E, five is B, six is F sharp, seven sharp is C sharp. C sharp has all three fingers down on the sharp keys leaving only two for chording, which is pretty good, but I made it so it actually holds automatically on the C-sharp, so your fingers are free to make five-note chords. John Jan's piano also allows you to go up and down octaves by just simply tilting. Tilt up for the high notes, Hold it flat for the middle notes, and then down for the low notes. The octave indicator lets you know what octave you're in. High, middle, or lower. To use more fingers for chording, you can use the hold button by pressing down the number of sharps you want to get A, in this case, the A layout, then press the hold reset button and it holds the A layout. If there's a change in the key, you can just touch any sharp going directly to that key layout. The iPod and the iPod Touch only allow you to do five touches at a time. So, uh, if you accidentally do more than that, it may freak out a little bit. Just hit the hold reset button on the side and that will bring you back to the layout for C. Now that you know your way around Johnny Jam's piano, start off with a simple melody that stays in one octave and one key, and then move up to more complicated compositions that have a variety of octaves and keys. You can have hours of fun just learning new songs. Or you can plug into your computer and record your compositions, or amplify and play with your friends. No matter how you use it, I hope you have fun with the Johnny Jam's piano.